All right. Looks like we've got just about everyone. How are we doing? Internal security remains solid. I've caught two Republic spies since Osis. Both were disguised as cargo pilots seeking work. Unfortunately, they fled before they could be caught and interrogated about their specific objectives. The next time you find a spy, I want them caught. Understood? Of course, Commander. My assets have brought in solid intel from all of the major battles along the front lines. I'll keep forwarding everything to Baywan for analysis. My people are using that intel to create new write-ups for the major field commanders on both sides. Should help us predict strategic probabilities going forward. Until we get a specific request for aid, I've deployed our fleet in a defensive posture around Odessan. There's, uh, one other matter we should discuss now that you're aligned with the Empire again. We've accomplished a lot here. I'm proud to have worked under your command. We've made the galaxy a better place. But I'm also proud of my past. I served the Republic for years. I can't fight them. So, I'm retiring. I've recommended a replacement, Commodore Pardax. Ex-Imperial. Very sharp. She'll serve you well. Lana's already vetted her, and I'll stick around long enough to get her up to speed. You've been a huge help to our Alliance, Baywan. Thank you for everything you've done. Thank you for taking a chance on me. Nothing so dramatic occurring in our science lab. Improvements to Odessa's planetary shields have been successfully completed. All right. Hilo? We've had to step up security for my crews. Piracy is becoming a bigger problem on their runs. Lucky for us, you're friends with Mandalore. Now that word's spread that her people are riding along, nobody messes with our transports. Good to hear. Anything else? Me and the crew have been running one of the old Thranta Corvettes. We're patrolling the route between here and Sakul. It's bad over there. Some of the city spires have closed themselves off completely. Others are actually taking shots at each other. And those gangsters from the Exchange? They're moving in all over the place. Nearly half the provisional government is tied to them somehow. I know they want to go their own way. But Sakul is my home. It's home for a lot of our people. I think we should try to help. Not a chance. I never want to hear about Sakul again. I guess I'll have to deal with it myself. Sana Ray is touring the reconstruction efforts on Voss, so I believe we're finished. That's all I have. Good work, everyone. There was one final matter for you. Lord Izar, a representative of the Imperial Outreach Division, has asked to speak with you. I've loaded his frequency into your holocom. Thought we could use a moment alone. I have to admit, it's weird fighting against the Republic. Probably should have seen a day like this coming. Somehow, I just never did. I get it. They've never once had your back over the years. Suresh brought out the worst in them. Even so, I need to know you're in this to win a war, not to crush my old home into dust. Don't worry, Theron. I won't ask you to do anything you aren't comfortable with. I appreciate that. I really do. I'm glad we could talk. I'll catch you later. Greetings, Commander. So good of you to contact me. How can I help you exactly? I serve within the Imperial Outreach Division. Specifically, I seek out opportunities to inspire greatness among our noble frontline soldiers. Darth Krovos is giving a speech to our forces gathered at Viking Space Dock in preparation for their deployment. This could be an opportunity to say a few words of your own. Your actions have made you a living legend, after all. Certainty of victory inspires confidence. Hearing that you are out there fighting the same fight they are will undoubtedly instill that confidence in our troops. Fine, but this had better be fast. Oh, even a handful of words from a decorated hero such as yourself will carry great weight. We shall await your arrival with bated breath. Safe travels.
Jonas, are you aware of this rally for Imperial troops on Viking space dock? I've heard about it. Sounds like a great opportunity for you to shake their confidence a bit. No need to risk your cover or anything. Just get them to second guess whether they can win, and stress will do the rest. Let me know if they have decent drinks. I might just sneak in myself. Perfect timing, Commander. Darth Krovos is just finishing up. Follow me. I can sense the strength in each and every one of you. The passion for victory, and the power to achieve it. At the muzzles of your blasters, at the points of your blades, our ancient enemies shall finally be destroyed. FOR THE EMPIRE! We meet again. Zasha and her family send their regards. With your alliance fighting alongside the Empire, victory is within our grasp. Congratulations on joining the Dark Council. Thank you. I hope to serve our Empire as ably as you have. They're all yours. Together, we are marching back to war, to fight the Republic, to win! We all know this isn't the first time. We've all had friends or family who have marched this same path and never returned. We've spilled a lot of blood trying to beat the Republic over the years, lost many lives. But I look at all of you and I see soldiers. Warriors who won't let any of those losses slow them down. We can't give up now. We won't. Empire! 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 Uh, th thank you, Commander. To your ships! And to victory! Uh, thank you for your time, Commander. Very, very enlightening. Let's just step this way. Nice job. Especially that ending. Wow. They definitely did not leave full of confidence. Well done. <laughs> 